Good morning, everybody. I got um, got a package to take to FedEx. I'm gonna hit a thrift store I go to often and uh, see what else I can find today to do today. I got a bunch of stuff to list, but I'm gonna go pick up some stuff too. And let's see what we get into. Right, I'll see you in a bit. Yeah, we did the right thing, just kept facing that way. Talking that way, huh? <coughs> Did I miss all the good stuff? I'm gonna get this thing. Can I just leave it up here by the couch? Yeah. It came on. Hopefully, it, hopefully it sucks <laughs> in a good way. what I got there uh, take it home show you what I got this is what I paid $15 yeah let me get this stuff home 
made a rookie mistake. I did not get the vacuum cleaner. Set it up front. Didn't pay for it. Should have paid for it right then. And he sold it to somebody else before I got up there to pay for it. Uh, kind of my fault, kind of his. I told him I was getting it. He said he'd watch it, and then he forgot. But lesson learned, rookie mistake. Won't do it again. Uh, let me get this home, and I'll show you what else I got. All right, so we're back home now. And uh, I love my box to show you what everything I got. Oh. All right, this. Hold it in there. It's completely empty. It goes to a train, but it's to this Marks HO train set. Uh, looks rather old. I figured the box is probably worth something by itself. When I was there, I put the insert out. It's got all the inserts and everything in it still. But I put this insert out, and under this insert, some of the old punch out things for the houses. Let me see if I can show you without messing them up. See, there's a lot of these in here. So I'm sure these are probably worth something. Uh, some of them have been punched out already, like that one. It's already been taken out. Really don't want to punch them out. I'll try to leave them on the card if I can. Yeah. Looks like a lot of them are still complete. There's all different ones in here. Different, uh, different buildings and such. Pretty cool. Actually, that might be the one that was falling out of this one. A roof to something. Let's just take them all out and look at them. I wish the train had been in here. I'm sure the train probably worth something. I didn't really look up. I didn't look up comps on any of this stuff yet. But uh, it's starting to come apart a little bit. So I'll put that in the listing when I put it on eBay. Some more pieces. Another piece of roof. Looks like most, looks like maybe all this. Oh, those are the pieces missing. That, that's the other piece, I believe. So. And they're all in really good shape. Looks like they stayed underneath this piece of cardboard that was in here. Here's the pieces to the where well, the roofs went that I found all the roofs loose. And 15 easily assembled units, and it tells you all of the farmhouse, railroad station, signal tower. I don't know if all these are in here. I'll have to go through all of them and look at them piece by piece. Well, there's another one under here. Thought that was really cool. I mean, even the old, the old box and everything looks really cool. Somebody might be missing the box and needed to complete their set. So, yeah, that's all those that are in there. And there was one little man, one little tiny man. I don't know if a tiny man by himself would be worth anything, but maybe I'll keep him. I'll put these back in here. Yeah, so if you see boxes, look underneath the cardboard. Sometimes there's stuff in there. Alright, I really don't know if this is worth anything. It looks the the plastic's pretty yellowed in places and it's got a good crack right there. I've sold stuff like that before. People usually don't care as long as whatever is inside of it. But it's a uh, a small vac, I guess for cleaning in your Clean your hot tub or something with maybe. Uh, cleans like magic with garden hose and filter bag. Yeah, so it's still new in the package. So I figured I'd pick that up. Like new in the package stuff. Uh, this looks older. It's a intercycle garage door closer opener. And it's got the box and it's brand new sealed. Got all the wiring in it, so I figured that'd be worth at least a couple bucks. Uh, oh yeah, I got these. 
and I actually use these sometimes. It just depends. Six by nine paper envelopes. I mean, if I got something flat to mail, it's not going to really do too much damage to it. I'll mail it in this, or I'll put a picture. If I I sell photos every once in a while, older photos, I'll sandwich it between some thick pieces of cardboard, put it in this. I mean, it's going to protect it good enough to get it there. I've never had to complain about them. Those need to go on my shipping stuff. I got this. It's a Niles N I L E S. SPS4 speaker selection system and it's got four speakers I believe yeah four speaker selection don't know if it's worth a whole lot looks pretty clean looks in good shape I might be able to test this I think I have something I can test it with and I picked this up I don't think it's really worth a whole lot by itself it's a one pack it's a mini cassette for like uh, the video cameras that take many cassette players, I believe. Yeah, exceptional picture and sound reproduction. So yeah, it's for like an old camcorder, mini camcorder tape. Um, I'll save it, and I get a camcorder that takes one of these. It's worth anything. I'll I'll just put it with it. Oh, I picked this thing up. It says it's an Apple product signed by Apple, and it says uh, on the thing. On the book, Apple Thunderbolt Display, which that is like a whole TV system, I believe. But what was inside of here is just this one little piece. And I don't really know if it's worth anything, but I mean, it's an Apple product, so I picked it up and it went in my tub. I paid $15 for the whole tub, so one little thing in the bottom of it. He usually just looks in there and kind of gives me a price, so it's not really, it doesn't really go through everything all the time. Um, I figured though, this is a tiny piece and it sounds like it actually goes to a whole system. If you're going to lose a piece, that's probably the piece you're going to lose. So it might actually be worth something. I'll have to look it up later. Um, I seen this in the same box and I seen it said iGo. I thought it might have been some kind of uh, Apple charger of some sort, but it's not. It's a, it's an adapter charger. It's one of those that's, I didn't realize this till I got home, but it's one of those that plugged a little adapter in for different ones. I don't think it's really worth a whole lot. I haven't looked it up yet. I seen the end though and realized that that thing came off and it's probably not, probably not anything. I got a couple of these. These are American Olean ceramic tile bath, uh, bathroom corner shelf. I'll open one show them to you. I always pick up like home hardware. Bath stuff does good sometimes. It mounts in the corner of your bathtub, shower, hold your soap, whatever, accessories. It's a pretty good size. Um, I got two of these. I did, stuff like this don't typically, they don't always sell for a whole lot, but usually somebody eventually buys it. They break one or need one or something. So two of those. Maybe even for $10 a piece, that's 20 bucks right there. So, it'll be easy to list. They're still technically new. Uh, seen this, I don't buy a lot of Christmas stuff. Oh, and it's, well, didn't see this before. It's a Department 56. There we go. And it's a, Guy, it's a Christmas guy sitting on the bench reading the newspaper and this looks like it come unglued yeah I'll probably just glue that back on there if it's worth messing with a little package but you can see the glue on the bottom and the glue on the bench so that's an easy fix and I'll just I'll list it if it's worth anything Christmas stuff sells not in Christmas I've sold a handful of Christmas stuff but oh, I see this thing, I don't always pick up, I, I like to pick up cameras, but stuff like this I don't always pick up. It's a Fujifilm Endeavor 3500iX, I'll put a zoom on that, but uh, well, it was weird looking so I picked it up. This little piece comes off and that's the front of the camera and it flips over. 
and goes to the back of the camera. So I thought that was kind of kind of weird. I haven't ever seen anything like that. Um, it doesn't power on. The battery's dead. I may have a battery to test it with. Um, I'll just have to see. So I don't know a whole lot about it. It was just interesting, so I grabbed it. Might go in my camera pile. Uh, got a little JVC remote. Probably goes to. Looks like. Oh, it says VCR. Oh, it might go to a, like a DVD VCR or something. Shift VCR, slow display, snapshot. Hmm, I'll have to look that up. I said JVC on it. It's, it's tiny. I figured I'd give it a shot. Looks like it's in pretty good condition. Uh, got these. They're Ralph Lauren brand. I pick up glasses every now and then if they have like a name brand on them. I don't know if you can see that. And they are RA7071. Right there. And with their prescription, um, I'll sell them as frames only. And yeah, one of them's pretty pretty good prescription in there. Um, they'll sell alright sometimes. You go to the buy glasses if you can't if you don't have insurance, you go to buy glasses, they're expensive. So a lot of people will buy them used like this. <clears throat> I got, I don't know if these are worth anything. Um, and they're dirty. I have to throw them in the wash. Some Brahms. Uh, Brahms aprons. And there's three of them. Uh, I'll clean them up, see if they look like they're worth messing with and I'll probably lot them all up all three of them together and let's see I also got Walmart vest I don't know if these are worth anything either just throw them in the bottom of my box didn't take up much room I'll see if it's worth anything if not I'll go leave it on the aisle at Walmart somebody will claim it um, I got this, thought it was older at first, I was kind of just grabbing stuff, but then I didn't notice it said 2016 right there at the bottom, Muhammad Ali, um, it's a little too small for me, Delta Pro Weight, I don't really know clothes that much, but I've been trying to pick up odd and end things, if they have something weird on them, um, I thought this might have been an older shirt, but it's obviously not. Well, let's see what else. Oh, I got a Bible. Tyndale Life Application Study Bible. Uh, New Living Translation. It's bonded leather. Uh, it's got the gold edge. Um, lots of bookmarks. Be nice if I could find some money in here. You never know. Always check your books for money or whatever. You find some strange things in books, just strange notes and things like that. It's a cool bookmark sometimes. Nothing, nothing too interesting. I'll flip through it again later. More. And oh, one last thing. This is probably the oh, well. I missed the vacuum, the rainbow vacuum with all the attachments and the power head. Set it up front, told the guy to hold it for me. And he forgot that I told him and sold it to the next lady that came through the door. So that kind of sucked. That's a rookie mistake on my part. I know better to just set stuff up there unattended. I should have paid for it, took it out the door right then and put it in the car and then been done with it. And then came back in and bought whatever else I wanted to buy. Um, I've parted one out exactly like that one before. Um, that's usually stuff like that I'll part out. It's pretty good size and you're not going to get as much for it if you're just uh, if you're trying to sell the whole thing. Um, if I remember right, the base that, that holds the motor part, I don't like take them all the part. I'll just take the wheels off. I'll take the, the caddy off, like that particular one. Um, I'll take the the container on the bottom that holds the water and stuff on that model 
and it just tells us the the parts that'll just come off like you the, that you just snap off um i think i sold the power head for 40 ish dollars last time i had one and 35 to 40 dollars and the part that has the motor in it without anything else attached to it was another 40 to 50 dollars so I probably missed out with all them attachments a hundred dollar bill today and that was my fault i don't like making mistakes like that but it happens i will remember next time and the last thing anyway the last thing i got a life lesson huh i've learned that lesson before i don't know why i forgot it this time this is a to me i'll be able to see that one better to me it is a laptop messenger type bag, folds over, has a zipper up here, and I have not checked this yet. It's really clean on the inside. It looks really nice. I'm 99% sure this is leather. Uh, it's got a lot of pockets. Oh, there's a pin in there. It's oh, a nice pin. Uh, Oh, the luggage tag, more pins. Uh, it says, to me, if found, please call USA and then collect worldwide. Huh. What if there's a reward for it? <laughs> anyway, I'll check them all out real quick. It doesn't look very used. Oh, there's another one back here. Oh, that opens. Okay. Some receipts. And this was somebody bought an Aquafina water and some chapstick in 2015. So it's pretty pretty new. Oh, and a American Airlines passenger ticket and baggage check. Not valid for travel. Passenger receipt. Oh, it's an American Airlines ticket. Minneapolis, uh, Chicago O'Hare. Huh. That's kind of cool. Somebody was traveling. And it has a, uh, I mean, it has a bunch of pockets. Has the strap, which this piece I've seen. This is the only worn spot that I've seen. And they must have taken really good care of it, but I'm sure they couldn't keep that from wearing out if they used it a lot. Handle looks in pretty good shape. It's a really nice, really nice bag. This zips open the bottom and it goes, goes all the way through. But yeah. That's, I think this is probably the best thing I found all day. I think this brand's a good brand. I, I don't really buy a whole lot of luggage type things all the time, but I guess we'll see. All right, and that's all I got today. Um, don't leave your stuff sitting around at a thrift store. Somebody else might buy before you get to it. That's the lesson for the day. And thanks for watching. Hope you enjoy. Hope you got something from this and like subscribe do all that stuff and we'll see you next time thanks bye